Good morning. Okay, so I didn't wear my Fitbit to bed last night because I forgot it was charging and I forgot to put it back on. Um, but I feel like I got like just under eight hours of sleep. But I always feel like that, so I don't I don't know if that's true. Um, so I'm kind of like fucking pumped for myself. Oh yeah, slap it high. The problem is I feel like I could have slept longer, but as soon as my cat Franklin feels like I'm a little bit awake, he won't stop trying to get me to wake up. He's super, super cute and super, super cuddly, um, but he starts getting very aggressive if I don't get up. And everyone's like, oh yeah, well cats just want food. No, 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 no. This motherfucker just likes things to run on a schedule. He doesn't even care about the food. I mean, the food is a part of it that I have to put down the food, but he doesn't even eat it. It's just so he can watch Joe eat it. So Joe, my other cat, um, will eat the food and Franklin will just watch him eat the food and like make sure that he stays on a schedule. He makes sure that I stay on a schedule and he runs the house. That is how our household works. So I went to bed at like 11.20 and I woke up at 7.25, but I was definitely a little bit awake before I got out of bed to check the time. Is this all interesting for you? This is so interesting, right? I think that tracking sleep is kind of interesting. I like tracking things to see how they affect my life, um, whether it be drinking more water, vitamins, going to the gym. I just like to see, did that make an impact on my life if I adjust that? I definitely think that walking 10,000 steps a day does have a big impact on my life, so I really try to track that too. Anyway, I think another reason that I don't get that much sleep is because I wake up and immediately think there's so much to do today. There's so much to do. There's so much to do in so many different areas of my life. There's so much to do. And that's not, um, that's not uh, healthy for um, trying to sleep more is having your brain constantly tell you there's so much to do. I always have a morning ritual of um, drinking my coffee and then either reading or writing in my journal, just something that calms my mind down so that I'm not just like, oh my God, we have to do everything right now. That happens to me. Does that happen to you? Does that happen to you out there? Am I alone? Am I just crazy? Leave me a comment. Let me know. I feel alone. Um, so I'm gonna write in my journal now and I will see you after. <laughs> This is the vlog of Franklin not being able to leave me alone for two minutes. I'm just trying to edit my video. Excuse me, sir. I'm just trying to edit my video, thanks. May you bathe elsewhere. Well, I am very oppressed by the patriarchy today in this room. Thank you. Okay, I edited my vlog. But this guy didn't make it easy. <laughs> Did not make it easy. I sometimes wonder if I had a job that wasn't at home, what would you do? What would you do all day? He doesn't like it if I even leave the room. It's funny how people say that cats don't show affection because all I get is pure affection from this guy to an aggressive degree. Sometimes he doesn't like when I talk to other people and he'll swat my face away from them. Like it's obsessive love, it's abusive love. Abusive, I tell you. Like right now, he's mad that I'm talking to you. He's looking away. It's okay, Funks. But yeah, I did finish. I did manage, even with this guy. What would you do if I worked at an office and not in my home office? My goodness. My goodness. We're both so lucky. Two hours later, we're both still here. Oh, you make it impossible to get up. It's only 3.30, but it is so dark and gloomy out. I don't want to walk, but I told myself I would walk every day. Can't I just stay in here and have a kitty party? I was invited to a kitty party. What do kids call police? Yeah. And euphoria. Do they call them anything? Well, do they call them like 5 -O or po or anything? What do the kids call the police in euphoria? Yeah. Uh, I guess the... I guess the popo. I mean, I don't remember them talking about Maybe police. Maybe they call it the popo, like... I mean, that, that could just be me, like, being old that could be. and projecting my memories. That could very well be. Steve's writing a script right now. Look at how cute he is. No. All bundled up writing a script. Well, Stripe writing. Well, I've never seen this before. Cool? Usually he goes and, like, goes to a place and writes a script, but he's Skype writing. I know. We're usually underground. Where writing. do you... I hear Michael, but I don't see him. Um, oh, hey. Oh, hey. How's it going? It's going. It's Vlogmas. Michael, you're in a vlog right now. You're, you're in my Vlogmas. 
Oh, happy Vlogmas. Yeah, Thank happy you. Vlogmas. And happy Vlogmas to you. Uh, I can't I can't wait for a table full of energy drinks later. True. E empty energy drinks. Nikki's already seen my coffee box table. Here with me. Yeah. That's my ritual. Yeah, I know. I understand. It's usually a ritual done in a different place though, so I'm not I'm not used to seeing it. Good so point. I'm so glad to have witnessed the ritual. It is a ritual. Uh, what a what an honor. Um I'm going on a walk. I just wanted to say. Hey, what do you kids hey. call the popo these days? Yeah, please leave us a comment. It's it's for a script. In the script, we have kids talking about the police, but we don't know what the hell the kids call them these days. I think days. they call them the coppers. Oh, coppers! That's great, Michael. <laughs> it's coppers. <laughs> okay. I'm so young. That's a C O P P. -E I'm so very young. <laughs> Excuse me. It's 9.30 and I've been editing videos literally all day. I edited two vlogs, the one that went up today and the one that's going up tomorrow. And I edited a video for my main channel, which is a lettering video. And I just wanted to take a nap, but <laughs> this guy won't let me do anything. He won't let me do anything alone. Huh. What are you? Why are you obsessed with me? He's obsessed with me. Obsessed. I tried to take take a nap and he started biting my face to keep working. He likes a schedule. This man likes a schedule. He's like, it's not bedtime, bitch. We are not going to bed. But I'm so tired. I'm so tired. I didn't completely finish editing the videos either, so that's good. I'll just do it tomorrow morning. We're shooting Sticky Show all day and um, because I have to, I don't have to, but I wanted to stockpile for when we go to the Bahamas next week. Anyway, I'm gonna try to go to bed, but I don't know if he'll let me. I'm still in my office. Because on the off chance that I want to get up and work again. But I don't know. Well, I mean, you'll find out. 